Hi guys, Namaste. Welcome to Ankenesh Creations. So today's video, we are going to be trying to make some abstract painting with lots of experiments involving in it. So first, I am priming my canvas with some acrylic gesso, and then I'll let it dry completely, and then we'll start our painting. Now I am moving on with some iridescent acrylic paint or metallic acrylic paint, and I'm just. Uh, dropping the paint all over the canvas wherever I feel like. So making an abstract background with palette knife does not have any rule. You just go on with your color choices and I don't really decide in the beginning what look I am going for. I just start and after that I I should add this color at this point or this color. I just decide on the way with uh, going on with the process so palette knife and acrylic paint se hum bahut sare different type ke backgrounds create kar sakte hai, abstract backgrounds depending on what color choices you want to have and what kind of strokes you want to make like vertical or horizontal or mixed or circular whatever you want you can create so many different kinds of background using palette knife and acrylic paints so here I am choosing to make some vertical strokes with different color choices um, jaake, I'll add more colors and I'll try I was trying to make a little bit lighter background on the top and little bit darker towards the bottom side of the canvas so yeah I'm just choosing my color on the way mo moving on with the painting depending on how I feel like like which color will add some brightness and which will add some depth to my background so yeah enjoy uh, the process of painting the abstract background <laughs> Now here I am almost done with the background of my painting and I let it dry completely for one day just to make sure that it's dried completely and then we'll move on to the next part where lots of experiments begins. So when I started with this painting I had a basic idea to make an abstract background and using a hair dryer I wanted to make some flowers. So I took some white acrylic paint and hair dryer ki madad se I tried to flow it like to go um flow karne ki koshish kari to make some random flowers but the consistency of white paint was very thick so wo work out nahi hua. So next I added some water to so that I thought ki paani ke saath color bhi flow karega but sip paani ne flow kiya aur paint wahi ka wahi ra. So I tried to mix make the flower with the brush that didn't work out luckily jo piche ka abstract background tha wo puri tarah se sook chuka tha to i was uh, able to remove the paint easily now i'm watering down some white paint then i added the white paint to the canvas and again uh, used the hair dryer to make some flowers but as you can see it didn't work out nicely jo maine imagine kiya tha na waisa kuch bhi nahi ho raha tha so i again wiped it off completely and started again uh, with a clean surface now the experiment which turned out good comes on so now i'm dropping some paint using palette knife so this paint is watered down white acrylic paint aur fir main straw ki madad se is paint ko blow karungi so that i can gradually see where the paint is flowing and i can control 
what kind of shape I want to make the abstract flower. I was so happy with the result of the first flower that I thought that finally something is going to I was like that this is going to be a painting. So I added more and more flowers all through the canvas. What I realized with the hair dryer was I should have added little bit less paint and then I should have flow karna chahiye tha, uh, uh, hair dryer se paint ko so shayad ho pata next time mai try karungi but this time the straw came in really at a very good time or achhe se flowers started forming so now enjoy uh, making flowers with the straw Next I am using palette knife and that same watered down acrylic white paint to make some stems of the flowers and leaves of the flowers so for the leaves I will just be dropping little bit of paint on the side of stems and blowing it uh, with a straw to make some random leaves. Now again I'll be watering down some gold acrylic paint like this by adding some paint to the water and mixing it nicely and just we made white uh, acrylic paint se flower banaye the, in the same way I'm going to be dropping some gold watered down paint and using a straw so that wo gold paint white mein mix okay will make this kind of marbled effect so it this looked so pretty it looked more pretty after drying so random early I added some drops of gold acrylic paint and I blew it with my straw her flower may kuch different type ka effect aara tha, so it was so random and abstract and the process of making this flowers was so like fun even if you can try this with kids it will be so fun for them to make different shape flowers and leaves and everything so I would highly recommend this kind of project with doing it with kids as well Now our painting is almost ready and I'll show you uh, how it looks once it dries completely. Meanwhile, I'm also going to be showing you uh, how I created this flowers on a small canvas. So if you remember, we created some palette knife bookmark and a canvas, small canvas painting a uh, few videos back and on that small canvas, I uh, added this kind of flowers and it looks so pretty. And now let's see how the final painting looks like. So this is how it looks and I think it looks so colorful and pretty. It will really brighten up the space wherever you will hang this kind of painting. I really love it and I want to make a bigger version of this kind of painting. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and I'll see you soon. Like this video if you liked it and subscribe if you haven't already. Bye! Love Pink Creative. Thanks for watching.